cheek. Please don't give me hype. I'm hype. Left cheek, right cheek. Write my name in ice. ice. Real ass, real ass, real ass, real ass. Got this shit from Tina. I'm a Nikia here with a health vlog. So I haven't done one of these in a minute since I did the RI28 challenge, which is now called what, babe? Like X, X28? Or but they changed the name of it, anywho. Um, we moved and got married and we were working out before the wedding. And then we like slowed down off of that. And then um, we were on quarantine, you know, shout out to the year 2020. Almost two months, two months. My husband and I started running three times a week um, for at least 30 minutes. And we weren't seeing results. And I personally told my husband, I was like, I'm not seeing anything. Yeah, my stomach is a little bit flatter. I feel like I don't hold on to stuff as long, but like, I'm not losing any inches. I try not to look at the pounds, but I got on the scale. I'm not losing any pounds. I think I'm like 168, 169. Um, it's the heaviest I've been without being pregnant. Um, but like 140 is a good place for me. But we decided we weren't seeing any, resu any results and we were like, okay, we need to change our diets, okay? We need to get back on our eating schedule, portion control, meal planning, because even though we are in the house, you know, I feel like we still need to meal plan. So we're going back to that. And one thing that we did do on R28 that we liked was eating at certain times. So eating every three hours. And we also um, decided that we want to eat cleaner. So eating clean is like less processed foods. Some people even take it to the extent of not eating dairy, um, eating more organic things. But before we do that, we need to like detox our bodies. So I think you saw in the beginning, the cover of the book, uh, we're gonna be doing the 10 day green smoothie cleanse. So this is to help like get rid of, get rid of all the toxins and stuff. Um, in your body and sometimes you can't burn fat or get rid of extra fat deposits because of all the stuff that's just sitting in your system so my mom had this book and there's actually like a little questionnaire in the front there's a um, shopping list in here there's the smoothie recipes it tells you what to do for each day it tells you the benefits and um, I'll list some of the benefits on the screen um, but we're about to go grocery shopping, so I was looking at different stores, just seeing what they had and seeing prices. But my go-to is always Walmart, so I'm gonna take y'all grocery shopping with us for this smoothie cleanse. Bye bye, later. Enjoy our video, it's free. Yeah, I'm gonna take y'all on this journey with us as we 10 day cleanse. Salted is what you say, but they're not good, so I need to figure out another something to get. <laughs> oh, that means it was just on a big farm. <laughs> a lot of, yeah, big farm meant a lot of acreage.
Hey beauty babes, it's Nakia. We're back. And uh, we're home. My camera's so good. These are our grocery bags. We went to Five and Below. Got some smoothie bottles. Now I'm about to prep all the smoothies. Let's go. All the smoothies are packed up. <laughs> Some of the bags won't close, but here they are. Gotta put them in the freezer. And I have all these greens left. I have those containers, and then I have three, and then I have spinach. So I'm thinking maybe I didn't put enough in the bags. So when we actually make the smoothies, we may need to go back and add some greens, which is fine. Yeah, so I'm gonna clean up, and I'm gonna see y'all on Sunday. All right, y'all. It is day one of the 10 day green smoothie cleanse. Uh, so first things first, we're going to take two tablespoons of apple cider vinegar with a water chaser, and we are going to drink our detox tea. Juice cocktail. You know what? I'm start with one. I'm not even gonna play myself. It, wow. says, it says one to two. Mm -hmm. You gonna know. shoot it or you gonna put water in it? Mm -hmm. Take Let's a see. little sip. That hit in the back of the throat. It don't taste bad to me. Yeah, it's just gonna shoot it really fast. Yeah. Now I will say, I just brushed my teeth, so it's real strong. I feel it right here. Hey. Cheers. Let that steep for seven minutes. All right, y'all. I'm about to get on the scale. This is day one. All right, y'all. I'm at 170 pounds. You should not weigh enough to even. You say you 200 pounds. pounds. Yeah, right. Okay. The shoes made you 200. Oh, let me zoom back out. There we go. All right. You did that 198 starting at day one. All right, y'all, we're about to make our day one smoothie. So, the smoothie for today is berry green. And in the book, it says that we can add things such as maca powder and black seeds, as well as coconut oil. smoothie it's a few ounces short but we'll see how I feel hey y'all it is the end of day one it is 8 16 p.m. I have about this much left in my green smoothie today was pretty okay mm -hmm. I think I got 16 ounces left or a little less than 16 but I'm a 
So I'm gonna finish it here. But I want another snack before I do that. <laughs> yeah, so we did do some snacking. We had peanuts. I had a banana. EJ had an apple. He had, had some, some peppers. And we're about to eat some boiled eggs. I don't know if we're each gonna eat two or we're I'm just gonna just eat gonna one. Have one. Yeah, but I just went ahead and boiled some, so maybe in the morning we want some. And then we have to take our apple cider vinegar shots. Tonight. There have to be shots, right? I'm up for well, it. I'm gonna drink. I'm gonna mix mine with water. Yeah, I might do <laughs> Cause it messed up my stomach. Mm -hmm. But it's been fine. We, ha I've only been going number one today. So I've just had like a hungry feeling, and every time I felt that, I just drink water, drink my smoothie, chewing my smoothie. So yeah, I'm not skinny yet, but we'll see. It's only day one. We'll see what happens. Good morning, y'all. It is day two of our 10 day green smoothie detox. We are getting ready to go for a run because we run three times a week, about two miles every time. Um, so last night, well, early this morning, I woke up with a headache. I don't know if that was from the detox but I did have a headache early this morning, but I forced myself to stay asleep so I can get my rest. Y'all, we're basically raw vegans right now, or vegetarian, because we had an egg last night. EJ said he feels skinny already. We just got back from our run, y'all. Did good time, our average pace was 12.45. We ran a longer distance than we've had. We felt lighter. You felt lighter, babe? Good workout. I love it. Oh yeah. Now I need to do my uh my chest workout. the end of day two I don't even know what to say y'all we're just at home we don't really do anything I finished my smoothie but yeah end of day two smoothie done this one tasted better added a little more splinter um I just feel maybe because we're at home you know feel a little tired just a little blah and maybe I'm just like emotionally drained and bored or whatever The last thing I have to do tonight is my apple cider vinegar drink. And then water is so much better than drinking it by itself. But yeah, um, I was finally able to go to the bathroom today. I wasn't backed up, but you know, I went to the bathroom and yeah, just been peeing and drinking water, so. We'll see how day three goes. I'm actually gonna be out of the house, so y'all. Hey y'all, it is day three of our green smoothie detox. It's doing pretty good. I'm actually hungry right now. I need to drink my smoothie. The smoothie's not green today, it's purple because of the blueberries. Um, and as you can see, we're on the road. So I'm going to Durham, North Carolina for a job interview. I know, right? job interview during a pandemic yeah so it's gonna be interesting to see um how this detox goes so we're gonna be in the car for a total of like six or seven hours so it's gonna be interesting i did pack a bag of detox approved snacks harper has her snacks and her lunch in there ej is driving down and I'll be driving back. So yeah, that's it. And you know, also we've been going to the bathroom. 
finally on day two and three it's good things are moving and shaking and getting out i'll check back in with y'all later hey y'all it's day four of our 10 day smoothie detox yeah so we went running this morning that was a little rough yeah the run was rough this morning i had to stop and like literally sit on the ground and get myself together i felt a little lightheaded um towards the end of our run so i'm back I drank my ACV cocktail. And these are our smoothies for today. Very peachy. I had to put it in two separate bags because there were so many ingredients. And I think that the apples, the apples are so big. So I know I haven't been like checking in with y'all all day, each day, but I really don't do anything but like drink a smoothie and watch TV and stuff because I don't have anything to do. So yeah, I just try to check in with y'all in the morning at night. And yeah, hopefully that's enough. And also, yesterday wasn't too bad when we were traveling. It was not bad at all. The worst part was my smoothie getting like room temperature. I don't like it to get room temperature. I like for it to stay chilled. <laughs> so that was a little rough. But once I got home, chilled it, and I was able to finish. I will see y'all, check back in later. All right, y'all, it is the morning of day five of the green smoothie detox so we are at the halfway point yesterday was weird it was pretty easy i didn't eat a lot i drank my smoothie mostly i had a headache this morning but my stomach is flatter i've actually lost some weight the scale is going down so so that's exciting Let's get day five started. Hey y'all, day five. I'm heading out to the store to get us some snacks. So we made it to the halfway point, but we need some more fruits and veggies and eggs to snack on. Oh, and maybe even some peanut butter, unsweetened. After this, so the scale is going down. I'm liking the way I'm looking. So, so far, so good on the detox. <laughs> 